this is good. If you want to see the best pedal board in the world, you might want to stick around. Let's just roll the intro. Yeah. What's up YouTube and guitar people, Hovac here and welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while since I've uploaded my last video, but the good news is that I'm actually relaunching my channel and I'm gonna be uploading videos every single week. Yes, very pumped about that. So if you are new here, consider subscribing and click that bell notification so you don't miss any future videos. Alright, let's just talk about some pedal boards here. I don't know about you guys, but I like keeping my pedals neat and organized. And for that specific reason, I just love pedal boards. I just... I have too many pedals because I actually collect them. And the reason I use a lot of them on my board is because I want to be able to capture the sound that I have created in Pro Tools during my live shows. By the way, if you want me to check out any of the cool pedals, just leave it in the comments. Just leave it there. So I've been searching for that ideal pedal board for such a long time that I almost lost my fate until I discovered the one I'm going to talk about and explain you guys why I think it's the best pedal board in the world. For me, the most important things are the build quality, cable management, which can be a mess if you have too many pedals. Well, there's no such a thing like too many pedals, but anyway. Functionality, the way you organize the pedals on the board, where does the power supply go, the output jacks, etc. And lastly, the overall look of the board. Yes, there are some custom made boards that you can buy, but you probably end up paying more and I guarantee that they don't look as good as this pedal board. And I found all these checkpoints only in this company. Drum roll! It's the Schmidt Array pedal boards from Germany. It's a German company with an English owner and all the designs are coordinated between Germany and UK by two musicians who are also trained engineers. So you guys can already realize what the quality is gonna be, right? I'm not gonna lie, I am endorsed by them, but I accepted the endorsement for one single reason, because I truly like what they are building for us guitar players. So a few months ago, when we were talking about making this video, I came up with this idea of having them to film the entire process of the production so you guys can see how well it's made. And once I get the pedal board, I will shoot the rest of the video here in my studio. They said, yeah, cool, we can do that. So without further ado, let's watch the video and then I'll tell you some more cool stuff about the pedal board. I think I'm gonna say the word pedal board like thousand times in this video. What do you guys think? Isn't it the best looking board you've ever seen? 
Alright, let me tell you a few more things about it. Number one, it is extremely customizable to your specific needs. You contact the company, tell them how many pedals are you going to use on the board, how do you want to position them on the board, they make a blueprint and get your approval before they even start making it. Number two, you don't need a separate case for it, which is super cool because the whole board itself actually is the case. All you need to do is just close the lead, which you can purchase with the board and you are good to go. And on top of it, it comes with a soft carrying case so you don't scratch the board. How cool is that? Number three, all the boards come with two USB power banks and LED lights so you can light up the board if you need to. I was actually stupid enough to break one of the USB connectors on the lights, but they are gonna send me the new upgraded light, so that's very nice of them. You can actually charge your phone with it. This is just... Go to their website and check out all the options they are offering and I'm sure you can find something for your specific needs, 100%. Alright guys, that's it for this video. All the links are gonna be in the description down below. I really hope you enjoyed it and if you did, I'll see you next week. Peace.